right, so here are 10 movies that honestly, whenever I watch them, they truly just inspire me to get up and take a trip. Like, seriously, I love movies. I'm a movie person. And it's something about just certain movies that just make you want to just get up and go. Some movies just inspire you to actually want to go and take a trip to either the city that's featured or just to go explore and experience some of the similar things. Eat, Pray, Love is actually a movie I've seen quite recently. Yes, I was late watching <laughs> this actually good movie. I heard the book was even better. But the movie really inspired me to just, you know... Hopefully, whenever I get to that moment or, fe or feeling, to just let everything go and re-explore yourself and create a whole new person. Um, another movie that actually inspired me to start doing girls trips, and hopefully sooner than later, I'll even get to experience Louisiana. But this movie just reminds you that, hey, some of the friends that you've had since college or even high school... Or whenever that you've met for such a long time. It's ne it doesn't hurt to just once a year. You guys all get together. Have fun. Catch up. And just create magical memories. And thanks to this movie. I now take girl strips. Another movie that actually inspired my trip to um, Washington D.C. And Boston was National Treasure. Like when I was watching this movie and you know just enjoying it I was like man I would love to see some of those sites wow I would love to go there too just to see you know and explore where they've been and just I'm a history nerd so this movie just spoke to me completely another movie that kind of you know ignited the whole adventurous thing for me was The Mummy I don't know about going to Egypt and all that because it's too hot and stuff. But, like, just the factor of, you know, the energy and the sights that were shown throughout the movie. You know, kind of get that Journey Jones going. Another movie that is kind of non-traditionally inspiring was We Are the Millers. They, this movie, I guess, could inspire you in a whole different way. For me, it actually made the whole RV traveling thing look more pleasant than I thought. I've never been much of a road trip person just from, you know, growing up being on road trips so much. But this just made, you know, reminded me that, you know, traveling in a group could just be more fun. Just to be completely honest. Now, Hangover. This one is out there but it, it sparked my interest to actually want to go to Las Vegas I've never exactly been one to gamble in that whole life but this movie and it just made it more I guess you could say it piqued my curiosity to just take a trip with friends and just to see where you end up um, another good movie that kind of gets that Wanderlust Jones going is Johnson's Family Vacation. Only because like this whole movie they spend trying to get to one location and all of this stuff happens. And they see all these places and experience all these new things. And honestly, that's what road trips are for. Just for you to get on the open road. You're trying to get to a destination. And, you know, things come up. Um, sightseeing comes up. St stories experiences, incidents, events, anything can pop up. Another one is Home Alone 2. Many people say, oh, this is like a Christmas movie. But no, honestly, when if you're just watching just this movie just to watch it, it really made me want to go to New York City. It made me want to go to New York City during Christmas time because all the Christmas trees, of course, and all the winter and snow. But just some of the sites that um, Kevin McAllister actually got to see, piqued my interest. I was like, ooh, I'm going to go to New York maybe one day and see what he saw and go explore things. Hopefully with no bandits, of course. Twister is unconventionally another one purely just because of the adventure and um, a quick pace of it. It gets you, you know, kind of, it's more of an exciting movie. There's a love story in there too, but I don't know, just the, just their fast pace of the movie and them going from town to town chasing twisters. I don't know. 
got me going. I was like, ooh, makes me want to get out on the open road. Another one is Now You See Me Too. This one, if you don't really, like, yeah, I watch movies a lot, but when you pay attention to it, they actually travel to a lot of different places in this movie, and, like, the sightseeing within it is impeccable. Like, I don't want to do any spoilers just in case you haven't seen the movie, but, like, just the fact that they go from place to place and it shows, you know, bits and pieces of the sightseeing and just the environment of where they're at, it helps. Like I said, just a quickie, but this is your 10 movies that inspire Wanderlust, at least for me. Subscribe.